Nathan Templeton. He was an Australian journalist. Templeton was previously the Melbourne correspondent on the Seven Network's breakfast program, Sunrise. Templeton studied journalism at Deakin University, earning a bachelor's degree in communications. Early in his career, Templeton worked at Network 10 where he appeared regularly on the network's breakfast program and also presented reports for 10 News First in Melbourne. In June 2012, Templeton moved to the Seven Network to join Seven News Melbourne as a sports reporter. He covered major sporting events, including the Australian Open. Templeton was the poolside interviewer for the Seven Network at both the 2016 Olympic Games at Rio de Janeiro and the 2020 Olympic Games held at Tokyo in 2021. His birth year is May 1979. He died on 9th of April, 2024, at the age of 44. Templeton was found dead near Barwon River. Sir Paul Fox he was a British television executive who spent much of his broadcasting career working for BBC Television, most prominently as the controller of BBC One between 1967 and 1973, was educated in Bournemouth and served in the Parachute Regiment from 1943 to 1946. Fox began his career at the corporation in the 1950s, writing scripts for the television newsreel program before going on to create and edit the popular sports program Sportsview. In 1967, he became the controller of BBC One, a post he held for six years, one of the longest tenures of any BBC Channel controller. His achievements in the role included the launch of the Enduring Dad's Army. His birth date is October 1925. He died on 8th of April, 2024, at the age of 98. Died from a stroke. Paolo Pininfarina. He was an Italian engineer, designer, and businessman, known as the manager, from 2008, of the Pininfarina Design Company. Pininfarina studied mechanical engineering at Politecnico di Torino before joining his father Sergio Pininfarina's firm in 1982 as a trainee stationed abroad with Cadillac and Honda, 1983, and then as quality manager of the Cadillac Alanti Project, 1984, and program manager of the engineering GM 200 at General Motors, 1987. He was born on August 1958. He died on 9th of April, 2024, at the age of 65. No cause of death was given. Toby Simkin. He was an English theatrical producer and impresario most notable for his work on Broadway and Off-Broadway and in London's West End. As of 2004, he was working throughout China, living in Shanghai developing a national theatre network and producing films and musicals for import and export. He produced and directed his first show at the age of 18, The Long and the Short and the Tall. On Broadway, his producing credits include the Tony Award-winning Long Day's Journey Into Night. Simkin was a member of the League of American Theaters and Producers. Simkin managed marketing and produced numerous shows for Microsoft. His birth date is April 1964. He died at his home in Shanghai on 9th of April, 2024, at the age of 59. No cause of death was given. Jamie Darmanin he was a Spanish screenwriter and film director. His films have been nominated for Academy Awards in the foreign language film category twice, in 1972 for My Dear Lady and in 1980 for The Nest. His 1974 film Captain Brando's Love was entered into the 24th Berlin International Film Festival. His 1985 film Sticko was entered into the 35th Berlin International Film Festival. In 1994, his film On the Other Side of the Tunnel was entered into the 44th Berlin International Film Festival. In the 1950s, he established himself as an award-winning playwright whose best-known works include Eve Without the Apple, Argos 1956, and Café of the Opera. His birth year is March 1927. He was married to Elena Santanja, a popular TV presenter. He died on 9th of April, 2024, at the age of 97, no cause of death was given. Paola Gassman. She was an Italian theater actress, daughter of Vittorio Gassman and Nora Ricci, and half-sister of Vittoria Gassman, 
Alessandro Gassman and Jacopo Gassman. Paola Gassman dedicated herself almost exclusively to the theater, with the exception of some sporadic but significant television appearances in comedies and dramas. In 2007, he published his autobiography A Big Family Behind His Shoulders with Marsilio Editor. She was also directed by her father Vittorio in shows such as Caesar or Nobody, The Theater Hurts, and Sincere Lies. Gassman Theater Company, she staged many shows in both the dramatic and comical and brilliant genres. She was the partner of the actor Hugo Pagliai. She was born on June 1945. She died in Rome on 10th of April, 2024 at the age of 78, died after a long illness.